Hey guys, in the fast lane here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to adjust your clutch pedal. Now, some of the main reasons of why you'll want to adjust your clutch pedal is one would be if you change out your clutch pressure plate or clutch release bearing, also named as uh, throw out bearing. Um, another reason would be if you change out your slave or master cylinder, it all can affect the pedal where it grabs and where it releases. Alright, so underneath where your clutch pedal is, this is the clutch pedal, it's a little dark, got a flashlight under here. So pretty much right up under here, this is where you're going to be adjusting it. Now if I can hold the camera, bear with me. Alright, okay I'm going to try to hold the camera right like this. And we're going to come in here, and we're going to put it on this sensor right here, and you're going to loosen it, like that. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to loosen the nut, if it'll focus, there we go, back it up, and then you're going to turn this, turn this guy back, and that'll give you your clutch pedal adjustment. Now you only want a little bit of play as you can see just a little bit before it actually engages the clutch. So you need just a tad bit of play. If it's stiff then it's not fully engaging or disengaging your clutch and it'll when you are engaging it, my bad, when you let the pedal out it's engaging it. So pretty much uh, if it's stiff then that means that it's not fully engaged and you can be slipping when you hit the gas the RPMs will start to shoot up so this would be the first place to look if your clutch is slipping so anyhow back it out give yourself just a little bit of play and then tighten that nut and then you're pretty good to go so after adjusting the pedal you pretty much just want if you can see from the side just a little bit of play see it's it's right there it's about to engage it's about to start to apply pressure on the clutch slave and master cylinder so you just want a little bit of play and you notice you don't hear any rattling it's not like all clanky it's still tight but if you get it to where you can't move it at all then the clutch might not be fully engaging so you could be slipping so make sure you uh, Look at that. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go ahead, comment, like, and subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out my Facebook page, website, and Android app. All that can be found on my YouTube channel in the About Me section. I'm in the fast lane, and I'll see you guys next time.